Yesterday news broke that Arizona Representative Trent Franks would be resigning at the beginning of 2018 due to some allegations that were going to be made against him. And he had stated that it was because of the fact that he had discussed surrogacy with two of his staffers. But he didn't really dig into the de or share any of the details of that. Now today things changed a little bit. He has decided that he will resign immediately and the Associated Press broke news through a tweet that said the following. Associated Press exclusive, former aide says GOP representative Trent Franks offered her $5 million to carry his child. Wow. So um, just to wow. give you some more background and context into this story, uh, Trent Franks and his wife were having a difficult time conceiving. And so uh, they uh, had a surrogate to carry their twins. But then later they decided they wanted to have more children. His wife had had uh, several miscarriages and uh, apparently they finally found uh, another surrogate to have um, more of their children. Uh, but. I guess these conversations were going on among his staffers. And as you can see from what the Associated Press is reporting, one of his staffers was offered $5 million to carry his child. So first of all, where the hell is he getting $5 million? No kidding. <laughs> it's crazy. Right? Man, you know, if you run for Congress, we now know this because, uh, you know, uh, because of just Democrats. We're, we have average regular Americans, middle class Americans uh, running for Congress. Like it's supposed to be in a democracy. And then you realize, oh, you're not allowed to get paid for a lot of the time that you're running. And so you have to quit your job and not get paid. So you almost have to be a millionaire to run for office in the first place. And then once you run, and if you ever go out, then you're gonna get millions of dollars to be a lobbyist, etc. So I guess a lot of these congressmen have $5 million sitting around to wow. offer their staffers for sex. Let's keep it real now, okay? He said that, uh, it, that it was because they were having, quote, a discussion of surrogacy with two previous female subordinates making each feel uncomfortable. Yes. This was not about a discussion of surrogacy. This was not a theoretical, oh yeah, you know, my wife and I were, this is that's the way Frank's framed it. My wife and I were going through the surrogacy and I happened to be talking about it at the office and I guess some women heard about it and they were uncomfortable, so I'm running for the hills. That is not what a Republican resigns over, <laughs> okay? And Paul Ryan says that, that he found the allegations to be serious and requiring action. And that the speaker takes seriously his obligation to ensure a safe workplace in the House. No, Trent Franks did way, way worse than having an innocent conversation about surrogacy. No effing way, that's why he's stepping down. The reality is, at a minimum, he asked these staffers to be his surrogates. I'd love to know how he asked them. Yeah. I don't think that this story is complete. I think that more information will come out in the coming days. And I think the reason why he said that he was gonna resign yesterday was because he wants to get out in front of it, hoping that more details don't get leaked, that no more reports come out. But I think that regardless of what he does, more reports will come out as we have seen with the Associated Press. By the way, I do wanna read you his statement from today. He wrote the following, after discussing options with my family, we came to the conclusion that the best thing for our family now would be for me to tender my previous resignation effective today, December 8th, 2017. As my old Jamaican girlfriend used to say, whoever wants to stay, 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 whoever wants to run, 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 run. Okay, that guy is running, okay. How can anyone think that it's a good idea to ask their subordinates to carry their children? I guarantee you that's not all. Good news, not only can we replace Trent Franks, we can replace him with the first transgender woman to ever serve in Congress. So we already had a just Democrat in that race, Brianna Westbrook. And she's fantastic, she's progressive, she's uncorrupted. Wouldn't it be amazing to have someone who does not have to answer to corporate PACs as your congressman and to replace Trent Franks? That would be awesome. And now she's got a great chance of being able to do that. So if you wanna check out who she is, go to westbrookforcongress.com. That's her website. And if you're in that district, please volunteer to make that happen. And if you're not in that district or you are and you wanna help in other ways, Go to justicedemocrats.com slash Brianna, and there it is, justicedemocrats.com slash Brianna. Whenever we talk about these links, the links are always in the description box if you're watching on YouTube and then the comment section on Facebook. And now there's actually a cool little corner, left corner on the YouTube videos. Left corner, is that the left corner? No. 
No, anyway, that corner, okay, <laughs> where there's a little eye, and if you click on that, it also brings you the uh, to the uh, links. So go help uh, replace Trent Franks with an awesome progressive. If you want to get the whole Young Turks show every single day, become a member, tytnetwork.com slash join. And once you do, you'll be saying, you know, I'm like a smart person. Or you might say, I think it's weird. Or you might say, oops. No, that won't be that one. It won't be that one. It'll be great, trust me. TYTnetwork.com slash join.